and we are starting off with that light snow on the ground in parts of the Miami Valley. Otherwise, it's just a cold morning. Your dog walking forecast, if you are heading out early, grab your warmer jacket. We have temperatures in the 20s, and we're looking at overcast sky in a good part of the Miami Valley. Even a few flurries will be possible, but no accumulating snow is expected today. And in fact, things will improve going into the afternoon. At lunchtime, we'll be near 32. It does look mostly cloudy at noon, and then a little more sunshine breaks through those clouds between 2 and 4 as we stay dry and push into the upper 30s. So we do crack the freezing mark today, but it's still going to feel pretty cold. Temperatures are going to be running about 6 degrees, maybe 8 degrees below normal, depending on where you are, as we continue to see the frigid air in place. We do get warmer Thursday and especially Friday. Friday is going to feel like spring, and to go along with that warm-up, we have rain on the way. That will arrive at the end of the week and even the potential for some rumbles of thunder. So today and tomorrow, generally looking dry outside of a few morning flurries today. Thursday or Friday is when those rain chances go up, 60% chance they will go even a little bit higher Friday night and then Saturday right at 60. And that's the time frame that a cold front will be approaching and crossing through the region. As that happens, again, we may hear some rumbles of thunder in our severe weather outlook for Friday. Uh, greatest to our southwest with a slight risk in southern Indiana, Illinois, and western Kentucky. And the Miami Valley is included in a marginal risk, and that goes for Richmond, Dayton, Xenia, Eaton, down through Middletown, Springboro, and Wilmington. The main threat with this is going to be some damaging wind with any thunderstorm that moves through, and it's especially going to be Friday overnight. So uh, the potential is there for some stronger storms at night. Live Doppler 2 HD radar back to dry weather after a few flurries have moved through these locations. You can see that as we track that batch of snow now off to the east. Still looking at a lot of cloud cover out there, but some breaks are showing up to the west and those will tend to roll in as we head through lunchtime. We'll start to see some develop in the western counties and then that will spread throughout the Miami Valley through the afternoon hours. It'll be dry for the drive home at five o'clock. An overnight will actually be mostly clear. By tomorrow morning, clouds will be increasing, though, and we will see those clouds kind of win out tomorrow. More clouds than sun expected through lunchtime, and in the later afternoon hours, we may see again a few peaks of sun, but clouds are definitely going to be a little more numerous. Dry weather is expected Thursday, and then the next storm moves in on Friday. Here's your forecast today. Morning clouds, afternoon sun peaks through. We're going to see a high of 38, so it will still feel cold. Tonight down to 22. It'll be mostly clear. And then tomorrow afternoon right around 48 degrees. Kind of chilly, but back above normal. We're expecting dry weather on Thursday with breezy conditions. Breezy Friday, spring-like with a high of 61 and some rain showers developing. Even some rumbles of thunder by Friday night. As showers linger Saturday morning in your Storm Team 2 seven-day forecast, but then the front comes through and those showers will end. And it's going to be a windy day with falling temperatures, a high of 54 and dropping, and it will be chilly again by Sunday.